up, gang? What up, Smart Rapid Gang? Today, I'm gonna talk about, well, something really important uh, as I try to make these videos, right? Um, the four things I wish I knew when I started rapping, okay? And these are things that if I had known these, I'd be a lot further today, like possibly 10 times further, but it took me a long time to understand these mistakes. That's the reason I made Smart Rapper was to teach you these types of things. So we're gonna go over those today, right? I'm Rob Level, this is Smart Rapper. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram, I'm almost at 300,000 on there. Release a new song every single month on my other channel that's at 107,000 subscribers right now. You can check that out inside of the description or on the main channel. Please hit that subscribe button. I do appreciate it, new video every day. Let's get into it. I do this full time, bitch. I do this full time. Every day, day. Stay up on my grind, bitch. All day, day. Stay up on my grind. Grind. I do this full time, bitch. I wish I knew how essential a team was, okay? Because, you know, uh, I really felt like I could do it all by myself. I don't need anybody's help. And that's why I'm able to edit my own music videos, shoot my own music videos, do my own marketing, do all that stuff. The reason I have these abilities is because I spent years learning these skills because I didn't have anybody to help me. But imagine how much faster I would have grown if I had somebody that could have done all this work for me. Like I still do this stuff because this type of stuff generally costs money for somebody to do. Like editing a video, this would have cost me at least $1,000 for somebody to do. But since I could do it myself, even though I have money to pay somebody, why pay somebody when I can do it myself and spend that thousand dollars on marketing? Now the thing is though is like not for things like this, it's it's a little bit different, but you still could be building your team of producers or people who just believe in you and are your cheerleaders or can connect you with other people. There's a very large there's like I have another video that's doing pretty well that is like the 15 different hats or different jobs that upcoming music artists have to do whether they like it or not, especially in the beginning stages. And eventually you start giving those jobs to other people. Okay, just so happens for me, I taught myself how to do all of them before I had, before I realized I could have had somebody else do it, right? It also comes down to trust issues, finding somebody you can really trust and people always give up on you or, you know, this is just in my experience. But if you're somebody who comes across that person who can actually help you, you're gonna grow faster, right? You think I wanna spend three, four, five days editing a video? Like my time is a lot more valuable now, okay? Or anything else, the marketing, like you still gotta handle the marketing because I'm the one with the marketing ideas, right? I'm the guy who owns the social media marketing agency, so I have a lot of the creative, creative ideas and then they, my team throws ideas at me too and we all work as a team to do it. But at the same time, if you can just find somebody else to do it, you're gonna save time, it may cost you money, but you're gonna grow faster and I wish I knew these things in the beginning. Number two, I always thought that money was evil. <laughs> Like, this may sound stupid, but I never did any of this for money. I always thought that, like, if you were doing it for money, that you were evil or that was, or you were bad or you weren't passionate about it and you weren't real, so that was stupid. And really, to me, you know, that was just the wrong mindset. The mindset you need to have is you need money to fuel your business. And when you really look at it, you need money. If you want to spread your message, if you have a good message, a positive message, or whatever your music is, in my case, it's to inspire people and motivate people, if I want to reach more people, I need money. I need marketing dollars. I need money and I need resources in order to create. Like this video wasn't free. This video cost a little over $5,000 in total to do ju you know, just this. And if I had somebody else edit it, I would need money for that. Like things cost money. Nobody generally works for free. You know what I'm saying? So you need money. Money is not evil. Money's not bad. It just depends what you're using the money for. If you're not using the money on the things that you should be using them on, that's when money's bad. It's like you're like you're using it to to, you know, you know what I'm talking about, right? But if you, you need money to fuel your career. You need the, the the marketing dollars to get your music heard, get a scene, get it paid for to get on World Star or, you know, take out um, people who are players or plugs uh, bring them out to lunch, bring them a lunch cost money, bring them to a nice lunch, you know. A lot of these things that you need money for, I think there's a hundred examples of what you need money for when it comes to your music and really getting ahead, but money's not evil. And I know a lot of you already like, duh, Rob, we know that. I listen to all the rappers who say, I got stacks and stuff like that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I get it. Your favorite rapper likes money, but generally they take the money and they waste it on shit that they don't need. They're not really thinking about music marketing, okay? Money's important. Money is vital for life. What money really is, is it makes life easier. And that includes it making your job easier when it comes down to really getting hurt. And a great example here is I never had any money. I was dirt broke when I moved to LA uh, 
it's been two years this month and I rode a bike for the first year and a half. I rode a, and I'm talking about a bicycle, okay? I paid for Ubers when I needed to go places, but I did not have a vehicle, I didn't have a car. Plus it's hard to park there. I got a car after all my businesses started taking off because I was putting in so much fucking work and grinding my ass off to get everything going. And when I started making money is when I bought a car. Right, but I didn't have any money. I'm just now able to fund my career like I've wanted to do for the last, you know, six, seven years. I never had anybody give me any money, right? That's why it was hard for me to grow. I'm not saying you need money to grow. I did a lot and gained a really strong organic fan base, even to this moment right now. I have not spent any money on marketing. This video is the first video in fees on that I'm actually spending marketing dollars on. Okay, I never spent more than like $500 marketing a project because I never had more than $500 to market a project. Okay, I never spent more than $500 on a music video. This is $5,000 plus dollars. You see what I'm saying? Now I'm spending the money. Okay, so you can still build a fan base without having money, but now that I have money, I'm gonna grow a lot faster. Number three, you may have seen the video that I made about this, but I, I do wish that I knew this. I do wish that I knew that music is a business. Business means it makes money, okay? All right, so it kind of goes back to number two, but you gotta think about this. You are a product, you are a brand. Like Jay-Z says, I'm not a businessman. I'm a business, man, okay? That's real shit. Because you, as the artist, are a brand, you are a product. Your music is a product that sells and gets listened to. You get streaming money, you sell merchandise, you do shows. This is why you become valuable to other people because you're worth money, they can make money off of you. They help you to make money off of you. You have 10 people around you that are key players and they're all making money off of you and helping you grow, okay? Now also look at how that comes full circle back around with needing a team. You're a business, okay? You need to understand branding. Go read some branding books. Understand branding, understand image, understand understand you know logos understand like how everything needs to be cohesive in its own way understand how to make money how money's made margins on products um, things that you could upsell what upsells are if you don't know what that is how to build email list how to make money from email list uh, things that you can make from affiliate marketing as an artist um, uh, endorsement deals sponsorships these are all things that make you money and most artists are just like I'm a rap if you don't understand everything else, not only are you losing a lot of money, but you're you're gonna it's really gonna slow you down. Because you need to be looking at yourself as a business. And when you start doing that, the posts that you make on your social media are gonna be a lot stronger. You won't just be posting pictures of random ass pictures looking like a goofy fucking wannabe rapper. No, you're gonna look like a professional rapper. You're gonna post professional videos. You're gonna look like somebody who is serious about what they're doing. The content qual quality of the content is gonna be higher. These are all important factors that when you first start, you're not thinking about, but they're vital because you are a business and you make money from that. People around you make money from that. You build your team off of that. And lastly, the first tip that actually has to do with the music is, I wish that I started assessing and looking at my music earlier on and actually looking at where I could have gotten better. Because when we first start, we're like, oh, this shit's amazing, even though we suck. You think it's good because you tell yourself it's good because you don't want to hurt your own feelings and you don't want to show it to other people or the people who do show it to you lies to you because they, they don't want to hurt your feelings, okay? I wish that I would have understood earlier how to really look at my music and be like, Rob, how can you make this better? Okay, what is wrong with this? Why is this not great? And when you look at why it's not great, how can you fix it to make it better? What are the things you can do? I wish that I would have been reading books. I wish I would have had the smart rapper courses that I have now on how to build rap flow and how to lyri write lyrics and write punchlines and how to write song choruses. And I wish I knew that method. Like now, like you can go, it's, some, it's as simple as going and taking my songwriting course and you can learn 10 years of songwriting in fucking uh, a, a six hour course. Because I, sh I show you how to go get the beats and I show you how to make the melodies and bring them into Pro Tools and write the song and all that shit. And it's just like, if I would have had all that information that's available now, because one, because I'm providing it, and you know, or two, or somebody else is providing information like that that I could have used on the music industry, like I try to provide to you guys and girls, like, I would have grown way more. But it was also, it came out to, you have to look at your craft, you have to look at your writing and everything that you're doing and your sound and your voice and everything, your mixes and everything, how can I be better? Because at the end of the day, it's what separates you from being an amateur and it's also what separates you from other amateur artists. It goes from not bad to, oh, they have a unique sound, they have a unique look, uh, they have they have great choruses, the mixing and the mastering is fantastic on this, holy shit, this is great. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're now a package that can be signed to a deal if you wanted that. You're now a package that can be, marketing dollars can be spent on to get you seen and heard. These things matter so fucking much and I wish I knew them when I started, okay? But again, that's why I made Smart Rapper so you can learn from my mistakes, all right?
Anyways, hope those helped. Um, let's go over them again real quick just so you have them, all right? Number one, I wish I understood how essential a team was. Number two, I wish I knew how essential money was. And I wish that was that was my own fucking fault. I grew up poor. We didn't know, I didn't know anything about money. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just glad I learned eventually, right? Number three, I wish I understood that it was a business. Okay, that's a huge one, really. And then number four, I wish that I was somebody who would have understood that I could be growing at a faster pace if I would have looked at my weaknesses, looked at my strengths, assessed what I had, taken courses if they existed at the time, and, or at least read books on songwriting or the music industry and things that I, I wish that I would have absorbed more knowledge then as well and just assess myself to make myself better. Okay, I'm Rob Level, this is Smart Rapper. Hope that helped you. Please hit that subscribe button. I appreciate it. I release a new video every day. I got the Smart Rapper community coming. It's gonna come with, I got 16 courses in there right now. I actually just shot a whole nother course on how to book shows in your local area, how to like guarantee that you can get the, the, the talent buyers at venues to book you so you can open for big artists, how you can sell tickets, all that stuff. I just made that. That was like, just like 20 videos. I just shot all that right now. I'm very excited. Um, I'll release a couple of videos from that onto this channel as well, just so you guys can get a little, little pieces of it as well. That'll be probably in the next couple of weeks, but I have so many courses you guys are going to be able to get inside of this Smart Rapper community that I've been building for like the last two years. I've already spent over $10,000 building this community, you know, paying the right people to like, oh, I can't get this to work. How do I fix this? How do I do this? Okay, I gotta install this plugin. How's this plugin work? Like, ah, so annoying. But it's happening. It's finally happening. New song every month. All that's happening. Please hit that like. Please hit the comment. Please hit subscribe and hit the little bell when you do so it notifies you every day when I release a new video. And um, big things are happening. I appreciate y'all. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, please comment below. What do you think about this? Okay. Did this help? Hope I'm inspiring you. That's what I'm here for. I will see you guys tomorrow with another video. Keep hustling. Small rubber. Gang.